Hello and welcome to your Vedic Lunar Scope. I'm Michael Reed, Vedic Astrologer, your host for this astrological journey. If you're interested in scheduling a consultation with me, please know that you can always do that through my Astrological Services page that you will see linked above. That link is also further down in the text section, along with the link to my webinar courses. So the truth is not always delightful. The truth is not always delectable. And sometimes it feels like the truth is not even digestible. At the moment, something is coming into, well, greater clarity. And as it comes into greater clarity, you're realizing just how much you may not like that greater sense of clarity. It's presenting you with something that, well, maybe you don't feel quite so happy that you're going to have to go through. Maybe you don't like the options for dealing with this scenario that you have available to you on the table, right? And for lack of a better way to put it, maybe things feel a little too close to the edge for your liking. And whilst you're facing this moment, though you're not really sure how to kind of hold things together through a challenge that you sense is approaching, in your heart, you know that you have to. A degree of loyalty to a situation or to a person is telling you that you really need to do your best and you do need to do your best. But if you let that overwhelming need to do your best get the better of your emotions, and if you let your emotions get all distorted because you're sensing the tension of the moment, then you're likely going to find yourself in a position where you get rigid minded in your approach to a particular situation. Yes, you have to be loyal to holding something together right now, but you need to be cautious not to be rigid-minded because options and opportunities can be presented to you in any moment. But if all you're doing is going, it's going to happen this way, right? Then you're gonna miss your chance. So at the moment, you really need to keep things in perspective. You're seeing things with a greater sense of clarity, and just because those things that you see with a greater sense of clarity may not be what you want to see, it doesn't mean that everything that you see with a greater sense of clarity is not going to be something that you want to see. One of those things may be something that actually is quite delightful, that actually is quite delectable. And even if it's not, it surely is something that will be relevant and a solution and an option to you going forward. That's going to do it for this look at Venus's transit through Jaishta Nakshatra from the 8th of November to the 18th of November 2019. Until next time, please do take the very best care of yourself. Bye now.